Hi, thanks for watching. I'd like to start with thanking 9,000 subs. Wow, I'm blown away. Thanks, everybody. Very encouraging. Right, now, previously I've made a couple of videos regarding art that I don't trust, right? So, I question everything. And this is, like, modern art, photography. And it's also manipulation. So let's see what they say first. So, it's a lake that lies above the sea. Well, I've got news for you. There are literally thousands of lakes and locks that lie above the sea. So, this one's called Lake, so, Lake, or Lake, let's, anyway, right. So we don't need a name. Quote pictures. Right. It's the biggest lake, lake located in the Faroe Islands. It's 30 metres above the sea level. See that space? It's 30 metres above the sea level. And I think the lake is quite level. And it covers almost three and a half square kilometres. Situated on the island of Vagar. And as you can see, the lake appears to be a hundred feet above sea level, but it is actually an optical illusion. In fact, the lake is only 30 metres above the sea level, but the steep cliff in front of the lake is a hundred metres high, making it look like it's sitting hundreds of metres high. And this is a manipulation. Right, so... This photograph was taken from this vantage point. Right. Okay, and even from this, you can see this, this looks like what? Maybe a hundred yards. Right. And again, through the same vantage point, creating this illusion. And this is manipulation. Because there's the real distance. And again, they're suggesting that this waterfall is the height of this. Again, this is manipulated. Because there's the reality. And look at the distance. Really? And here's the village, the northern top of the lake. Right, so let's look at the pictures. So this here, this bit here is the bit that's been manipulated. I mean, to look at this, you would think that was almost at the base of these rocks. And nothing could be farther from the truth. Right. Next. Right. And again, it's... it's creating the illusion through obvious manipulation that this is only maybe a hundred yards or so, if that. And again, they're suggesting the waterfall is this height. Right, and again... And this is it here. And there's the waterfall. And that was the vantage point. Right. 
Right, so again, the same suggestion. But it's obviously manipulation. Right, because there's the reality. And if this is the level C, then this will be the level H. Right, and here's the village at the top of the level H, because if you lived on a ball, they would be living at the base of a, a dry lake bed. Right, so, there we go on now. Before we go to the Faroe Islands, I'd like to show you some inland water in Scotland. Now this here is Loch Ness. And from this end to this end it is almost 23 miles. And I have been on the road around Loch Ness and military jets have flew past travelling at the speed of sound because I heard the sonic boom. Right, so let's go to the Faroe Islands. And here we are from here. Now the bit we're looking for is over here. Right. Yes, sir. So that's that's only three and a half mile. I'm not impressed. Right, so let's go down and look at these cliffs and stuff. Right. So that whoops. The photographs are showing from this vantage point here that there's nothing. So it's it's manipulation and they do it all the time. Whoops. Right, so, oh, there's a waterfall, right there, and there's your cliffs, and there's your lake, down here, right. So, I just thought I'd put that out there, because you go to question everything. Right, thanks for watching. Please comment.